The question is, is the Technoprop 7 worth spending your hard-earned money to buy? In this video, I'm going to explain all you need to know about this Technoprop 7. Is it actually worth it? What special features does this phone have? And what makes this phone so different from every other phones produced by Techno? So stay tuned and join me as I take you through this ride. This phone was launched in January 2023 and it comes with some of the latest features in which you can get on any low budget smart phones. When you look at the packaging on the video, it comes with a charger and it comes with a USB cable and also comes with a transparent cover and earphone which is actually some of the common things in which you get on these new smartphones. So apart from the fact that this phone is the latest phone that was launched in the year 2023, this phone also comes with the latest iOS which you can get on market which is Android 12 and each iOS 12 which can also still be upgraded if there's any latest update. And for the display, this phone comes with an IPS LCD screen and its resolution is 720 by 1612 pixel which is the display of the screen and now let's come to some of the common features in which everyone expects a smartphone a latest smartphone to have which i'm going to be explaining this phone comes with 64 gig inbuilt storage and it also comes with a 2 gig ram with an upgradable 3 gig ram which simply means when you have 2 gig it can be upgraded to 3 gig ram on which is which should be on the phone and the next special thing one thing also you need to know about this phone is that it's a dual sim phone which simply means it uses two sim card two nano sim cards and one sd card it also comes with a loudspeaker and a 5000 milliamp battery which simply means the battery stays longer. This phone has inbuilt FM radio and it also has fingerprint for security use. So whenever you want to lock your phone, apart from locking your phone with the normal code, you can also use a fingerprint to lock the phone. This phone is just a 4G phone, it's not a 5G compatible phone. So if you are hoping to buy a 5G phone, I don't think this phone is for you. This is a 4G compatible handset and one special thing I like about this phone is the camera because we are going to be coming to the camera and when you also look at the shape of the phone I like the shape of the phone is very sleek and it sticks to your hand so now when we come to the camera this phone comes with 5 megapixel selfie camera and it also comes with a 32 megapixel rear camera and let's put the camera to test this is how the back camera look and when you look at it you can see it's very clear and we're going to be testing the selfie camera which is the front camera which is 5 megapixel to see how it looks like as you can see this is how the camera looks like i think the camera is good for such low budget phone so please like share and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more of these videos. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day.